हेलो गुड मर्निंग माई डियर चिल्ड्रेन आई सौम्यकांत पति योर इंग्लिश टीचर वार्मली वेलकम यू टू योर यूट्यूब लाइव स्ट्रीमिंग इंग्लिश क्लास माई डियर चिल्ड्रेन टूडे वी कैम टू द लास्ट पार्ट ऑफ आवर सेशन इयर्स पास्ट सेशन कम्प्लीटेड दिस इज योर लास्ट लेसन and on that occasion i want to make it a revisional one in this class we shall just cover the text part because we are going to face a test okay then what type of questions will come there how shall we attempt them so we shall briefly try to discuss them and make it a memorable class i accept your comments and your likes so that's why without losing any time let's start our last lesson today class 7 english reader today's chapter is the test to a revisional question and the session is nothing but a revisional one see the beautiful sceneries the best sceneries susan the historical monuments the places you will see them enjoy them and we shall discuss the test in a enjoyable way it is not a burden some at all rather it is much more interesting and enjoying the types of questions generally we do face when we face a test amara summative test re आम नर्माली जो भाया क्वेश्चन फेस करू ताक आम आज गोटे डिस्कसन कर टाइप्स ऑफ क्वेश्चंस आर नंबर वन रीडिंग ऑन सीन पैसेजेस टू टेस्ट आवर रीडिंग स्किल वी ऑलवेज फेस एन ऑन सीन पैसेज टेस्ट ओके ऑन सीन पैसेज मीन्स द पैसेज that is not been seen before it means for the first time we came across a passages and we have to read them to test our reading skill the passages is given whether we do comprehend them or not pila mana padhi ta bujhi paruche ki nahi se skill ta ko test karya pai unseen passages diya jai thai aaj bhi ame gote unseen passages kariba ebam ta ko solve kariya सेकेंड आउ गए टाइप रोश्चिन्न आम पाइपर फिल इन द ब्लांक्स इट इज ए नोन क्वेश्चन फर यू अल फिल इन द ब्लांक्स मीनस द ब्लांक्स आर गिभेन ओके आम ओडिया क्वेश्चन शून्य स्थान पूरण कर फिल इन द ब्लांक्स आम किसी अपसन थी पारे बाक समय कि अपसनस न दि जाए आम ब्राकेट इन बोथ द वे वी कैन गेट फिल इन द ब्लांक्स पैटर्न क्वेश्चन then missing letters missing letters means some letters are missing to test your vocabulary for example b dash o k so you have to fill the missing one that is o in this way you can do missing letters that can be both vowel or consonant then matching columns type matching columns means column a and column b okay the words are given here in column a and in column b you have to just match them in this way you get matching questions then rearranging what happens here the words are jumbled word 1 2 3 4 they are jumbled you have to rearrange them you have to rearrange and make the sentence meaningful 
we can rearrange the jumble letters also we can rearrange the words to make meaningful sentences besides mcq questions you know mcq stands for multiple choice questions one question having multiple choices a b c d you have to choose the best option the most appropriate one then opposites viparita shabda high low set long light dark white black in this way just find the opposites and fill them or supply the opposite words then degrees you know adverbs and adjectives they do have degrees of comparison degrees of comparison comparative superlative degrees positive degree is given suppose tall taller tallest beautiful more beautiful most beautiful interesting more interesting most interesting so in this way the degrees of comparison also comes then another important thing is picture reading it is not new you at all because in your textbooks or in your worksheets number of book reading questions sorry picture reading questions are there the picture is given you have to just know what that picture is and write it name picture reading and the third last but not the least one is your writings different types of writings are there you do sometimes write small passages paragraphs you feel a invitation letter you feel a, a leave application isn't it it is given the format is given blanks are given and some options are there you have to just choose the options and fill them so in this way you can go for writings also so generally we find such type of questions in our exam now we shall go to the next slide see what is there this is see what is there there are some pictures isn't it and there are some known pictures of years very easy to recognize them recognize the pictures and fill and write in the four rolling lines in english you know there are four rollings and we have to write them isn't it and another one is your writing their names first we shall try this one see there are some pictures given here the given pictures are known to you see the first one what is there there is a home a house you know what a house is then what we will do you have to write it now question comes how shall we write the house in the four ruling i shall not do all just so th three four questions and you have to do them see the four ruling this is the first line this is the second line this is the third line this is the fourth line okay very important is this is called the capital line this is second line this is the base line okay very important all alphabets in english are always touch this line the base line third line okay so when you are writing house suppose you are writing a capital letter h h h o u s e house suppose you are writing small letter h write this h o u s e house suppose i want to write lion this is a lion l i o n lion this is your window so w w i n d o w window in this way you can fill the others what is this this is a mouse you can write mouse small letter suppose m o u s e mouse what is this this is a tree you can write t r 
E E tree. What is this? Hand. So H A N D hand. What is this? This is a jeep. You can write this is a kite, onion, fish, isn't it? So you can write this type of uh, words when they are asked in your question paper. But remember, you have to follow the principle. You cannot write like mouse like this. Okay. Sometimes you do write. That is wrong. Cup. What? C U P cup. You cannot write like because the rule is there. C U then P cup. Okay. How C P is written? Second line, third line, fourth line. Okay. U is second line and third line. C is first line, capital line. Uh, number two, number two, one, two, three. So you have to just recall how should we write, and in this way you can do. Next one is your another activity that is you have to just fill the missing letters. See what is there? What is this? This is we use when we comb our hairs. This is a comb. So you have to write here missing word C. C O M B comb. What you will write there? Comb. C O M B. What is this? Get. Okay. Get. What is this? Starts with K. Knife. What is this? Onion. O N I O N. This is a soap. So you have to write S O A P soap. This is a deer, so write it deer. If it is asked to write the uh, 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 capital uh, small letters, then do write like this is helmet, so write a small h. Ladder, small l. Parrot, small p. Torch, small t. In this way, you have to just follow. What is this? This is mango. M a n g o. This is your quilt. Q u i l t. That is other. Yach, frog. So write frog. So if you have to write the capital letter, then like write like this: B O X, box. This is your nail, rope, jar. So in this way, you can do of your own, no problem. So these two activities are very important for your vocabulary and writing purpose. Then see what is there. You can see. Two columns, column A and column B. In column A, the pictures are given. In column two, the words are given. The name of the words are given. You have to just match them. This is a matching type question. Just before we are discussing the matching questions. So now question come. How shall we match them? Okay. See how we are matching. See the picture. You can recognize them. Cat, ball, man. Moon, table, book. So this is the picture of a book. Now draw it. Okay. This is a table. Join it with table. Then this is a moon. So join it with moon. Then this is a man. Man. Now join it with C for cat. Okay. Now what is this? The ball. You can do it. So in this way, you can recognize the pictures and the words. You have to just match them. Okay. It is very easy as well for your exam purpose. Now let's go for another activity. See what is this? Fill in the blanks with appropriate vowels. Fill in the blanks with appropriate adjectives. See the vowels and adjectives. We know what are vowels. Actually, there are five vowels. Okay, and you know them. What are they? A, E, I, O, U. Isn't it? So these five vowels you have to supply. The rest twenty one are consonants. Okay. So you have to fill them with vowels and consonants. And here, see very easy activity for you for recognition of the words in English alphabet. There are two types of letters. One is small letter, we say also small case, and capital letters, okay, upper case. So upper case, lower case, or capital letter, small letter. I mean, what year? Taku bora akhara, chota akhara. Who na bilay? So we have to know them and accordingly match. See, this is a small a. 
so you have to just draw a line and match it d where is d this one is d so you can join it r you can join r so in this way you can do they are very easy for your purpose and now we have to just fill the missing letters okay see here i o a e i o u the vowels are missing we have to just put the vowels p dash r k just imagine p any word p ending with r k r a k p a k so obviously the answer is p a r k p a k okay then what is this n a dash l mane paka kon hei pare nail n a i l c o dash t vowel what will be this c o a t coat then b dash a t kon hei paribo b o a t m o o n moon you can write also of your own no problem see here s dash a l s p r s p r u c t u r e structure so in this way you will do them crown c r o w n crown teacher t e a c h e r teacher vowel v o w e l vowel night n i g h t night s o u n d sound t r i n train so you can do satisfaction see another word s a t i s satis faction f a c t i o n satisfaction industrial 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 cancer Aust astronaut astronaut cancer here you can do her she you can do of your own by supplying the words okay and second one is your consonants here the vowels are missing but here the consonants missing so you have to write the consonants only b e t a v l just imagine obviously it is vegetable b e g e t a b a l e vegetable this is night n i g h t sunrise r sorry this is not sunrise r i s e hoga this is crocodile c r o this is wrong crocodile d i l e crocodile teacher t a c h e r teacher time t i m e time this is sun sign s u n s h i n e sun sign okay s h i n e surya kirana sun sign so in this way you can do now we shall go for another activity that is we have done this next a matching type draw lines to match the rhyming words here the rhyming words are there the rhyming words means sounds they do pronounce alike okay the signs the the sound sound is important the sound alike words for example day 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 say day say okay trees 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 seeds dog 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 log isn't it white 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 sight you 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 true gleam 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 stream light light bright by by i peep 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 sleep moon moon soon isn't it so they are pronouncing producing the same sound they are called the rhyming words the pronouncing words are called the same pronouncing words called the rhyming words see what is given here catch match catch match saint 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 bent pet 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 net gate gate 
हेड सन रन मून सून बैट कैट गोल सोल्ड सो इन दिस वे यू कैन डू सच टाइप ऑफ प्रैक्टिस फॉर योर एग्जाम नाउ अनदर इंपॉर्टेंट पार्ट दैट इज योर आर्टिकल्स ओके दे आर कॉल्ड आर्टिकल्स एंड इन इंग्लिश देर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ आर्टिकल्स वन इज ए एंड एन दे आर कॉल्ड इंडेफिनेट आर्टिकल्स एंड द डेफिनेट आर्टिकल्स आम जब आर्टिकल को भाग करा पे टू टाइप्स अब वन इज इंडेफिनेट आर्टिकल्स एंड अनदर इज डेफिनेट आर्टिकल्स इंडेफिनेट आर्टिकल्स अगेन ऑफ टू टाइप्स ए एंड एन डेफिनेट इज द ओके एंड हियर वी हैव टू फील देम वेयर टू यूज ए एंड वेयर टू यूज एन ओके and it depends upon the pronunciation of the word if the pronunciation of the word starts with a vowel sound produces a vowel sound we shall go for an and if it produces a consonant sound we shall go for a this is the rule just see zakel z z z is a consonant sound so that's why a zakel and do is definite article first when we introduce that is an a zakel then we say the same zakel the particular zakel at the time it becomes the zakel here the see the word ant 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 so pronunciation is your vowel sound so here we used an now we have to feel them once there was dash zakel once there was a zakel dash zakel fell into dash tau the zakel the zakel fell into a tub the tub was see how we use indefinite article and definite article once there was a jackal any jackal okay indefinite one then we are concerned about that particular jackal that's why we use the jackal similarly there was a tub then we are concerned about that particular tub it is indefinite it is definite now the jackal came out of the tub okay so they both jackal and tub they became definite see in this way you can do no problem next see the use of have and has has is singular have is plural except the exception is i only i takes have okay i have you have otherwise all singular take has and plural take have remember this then we have to use a bicycle who has a bicycle who ha possessed a bicycle i it means uh, the uh, bicycle belongs to me i am in possession of a cycle so that's why i have mira third person singular number so it takes a singular verb that is has mira has a scooter it means a scooter belongs to mira or mira is in possession of a scooter okay so similarly we have to put have remember where we can put have remember these words i we you they and plurals they do take have have verb and where shall we put has she he it or any singular noun so this is very important thing i live in a small family we dash a small house we the subject is we so we comes in this category so what shall right here have we have a small house it has a beautiful garden it 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 has it has a beautiful garden my father has third person singular number has so in this way you can do it is easy for you just remember where to put have and where to put has it is a very important interesting part for you 
just it is the words are missing the letters are actually missing you have to fill the name of the fruits what we have to write here the name of the fruits okay what shall we write here the name of the fruits just imagine what type of words can be written here it is she a you will start here a p p l e apple so you have to write here a sorry p p l e apple then this is watermelon w a t e r m e l o n watermelon write here w a t e r m e l o n watermelon so similarly there are name of six or seven words here just like it is mango you have to just fill them and write them banana b a n a n a okay and here you have to write crossword puzzle very important for your vocabulary development crossword puzzle now we shall go for the passages the important thing for our reading skill we have to read it first then we have to write the sentences in the spaces given first we have to read there was a deep forest in that deep forest lived a rabbit one moonlit night the rabbit was walking happily near the forest on his way he came across a well he looked into the well and to his surprise saw a big white ball the white ball was floating on the water the ball was nothing but the reflection of the moon but he thought it was a big cake where did the rabbit live see the answer where is the rabbit live just imagine where might be the answer about the rabbit there was a deep forest so answer we will write we will write the subject is the rabbit so we shall write here the rabbit the rabbit lived here live live is the verb here did is given so the rabbit lived l i v e d lived where lived in a deep forest lived in a deep forest okay where was the rabbit walking where it was written where walking happily near the forest walking near the forest you have to write this one when was he walking near the forest when on the moonlit night isn't it so in this way you have to read them and find out where the answer is and fill them accordingly okay there was a monkey from raigar a poem is piece of poem is given here you have to read them there was a monkey from raigar there was a monkey from raigar who rode on a tiger they returned from the ride with the monkey inside and the smile on the face of the tiger there was a monkey from raigar so who are there in the poem there was a monkey and a tiger we can write they are who are they are we shall write there are a monkey and a tiger in the poem acha who rode on the tiger who rode on the tiger tiger a monkey a monkey so we shall write here a monkey in place of who we shall write here a monkey m o n k e y the monkey rode on a tiger isn't it so you can write where was the monkey from the monkey was from raigar who does they refer to they is plural they means the tiger and the monkey where was the monkey when they came back inside it was inside the tiger isn't it that is a known poem of yours you can read and practice it in this way about biju patnak a small paragraph is given here and the questions followed you have to write them 
Biju Patnaik was born on 5th March 1916. The name of his village is Jin Waga in the district of Ganjam. Sri Lakshminarayan Patnaik was his father. His mother's name was Asalata Patnaik. He studied in Ravensa College. He was a pilot. He was very brave and kind. The people of Odisha loved him very much. He died on 17th April 1997. People will remember him forever for his service and good work. Where was Biju Patnaik born? Question was where? Where means the place? You have to know which place? Yes, it is given the name of his village. Isn't it? You have to just put it there. What is the name of his village? The name of the village was Jidunaga. Uh, who was his father? His father's name written here? Isn't it? Then who was his what was his mother's name? His mother's name was also given here. You have to just write. Where did he study? He studied in Ravensa College. The college name is given there. Isn't it? So similarly, you have to just write down. When did he die? He died on 17 April 97. In this way, just find them out. Trace them out and write in the space provided. It will help you understanding a text for your reading development, for your reading skill. Whether you do comprehend the text or not. That's why the test of such type questions are given for your practice. Now, for your writing part, see in a box form it is written a biodata. It is also a known activity of yours. Name Ramesh Patra, age 9 years, father's name, sorry, place of living Chandipada, father's name Naresh Patra. Mother's name, Sangeeta Patra. School's name, Chandipada UP School. So, in this way, some data are given in this column form. Then, we have to reproduce them in our paragraph. A data kuni ke paragraph te lekhi ba. Bhoot easy. Name achi, aami khaal lekhiya, my name is Ramesh Patra. Age, I am 9 years old. I live in Chandipada. Shri Nam... Uh, Naresh Patra is my father. You can write also the name of my father is, the name of my mother is, the name of my school is. You can write of your own. So just reproduce the information given here and try to write in a small, easy, comprehensive paragraph. Make it a simple sentence, subject, verb. Then continue the, um, the part, rest part of the sentence. So in this way, you can do the writing persons of yours. Here is a person for you. You have to write your name, your age, your father's mother's name, the name of your school and you have to write a small paragraph. My name is Soumya. I, I am from uh, Ranjapal Primary School. My father's name is Surendra Kumar Pati. My mother's name is Annapurna Patri. In this way, I can write down my data's and write a small paragraph. Pile amgu lekhya pani kosto huye na. Ame jodi format te banana daba. A format ko reproduce kalle amu writing easier hai jibo. Ame boda helle same jodi amu writing lekhya pani kwa jibo. Ame prathay mona mona point bhabi daba. A point ko touch kari mu paragraph te lekhi bi. Ta pare se point ko nahi ki mu sentence banana hi pari bi. It will help you how to write a paragraph. So just practice them and enjoy the part of your own. Thank you dear children, you have enjoyed it, wish you best of luck, do practice them in this pattern and in this way I depart from you, I bid a farewell because this is my last class, I think you enjoyed my last lesson, have a nice day, thank you.